by Vet is an affordable color Doppler ultrasound with many functions that are found on more expensive models. This video shows its basic workflow and functions. First, press the patient key to enter the animal information. A patient ID number is automatically generated. After the information is entered, select OK on the bottom right of the screen. The patient information will now be displayed on the top left of the screen. Press the probe selection key to choose the correct probe application, and preset for the examination. First, select the probe to be used. It will now be highlighted. Then select the correct application and examination. Finally, select transducer number 2 to begin the exam. There are five adjustable parameters using B mode. Number one, to adjust the total gain of the image, turn the B mode button clockwise or counterclockwise. The contrast of the image will become brighter or darker. Number two, the TGC slides on the upper right of the keyboard can be used to adjust the gain at different depths. Number three, the depth can be adjusted by using the depth button so that deeper organs can be seen clearly. Moving the key up or down will increase or decrease the depth of the image. Number 4. To the left of the depth button is the focus position button. Moving it up or down allows a specific area to become clearer. Number five, if the TGC or total gain needs to be reset, press the AIO button or the automatic image optimization button. It is below the depth button. The total gain of the image will be automatically reset to the default setting. After a good image is achieved, it can be easily saved by pressing the image save button on the left of the keyboard. Images can be saved during real-time exams. The saved images will appear on the bottom of the screen. To the left of the image save button is the cine loop save button to save a cine loop. There are three measurement buttons, distance, trace, and calculation. Distance measures the distance between two points. Press enter to select the starting point. Move the trackball to the end point and press enter again to confirm. Trace calculates a selected area to measure. Press Enter to select the starting point. Move the trackball until the desired area is selected. Press Enter again to confirm the selected area. The results are shown on the bottom right of the screen.
Pressing the calculation button brings up a menu on the top left of the screen that shows the different calculation options available for different applications. Press the change button to select different applications. Press the exit key to exit out of the calculation menu. To add a body mark to an image, press the body mark button. Different body marks are displayed on the bottom of the screen numbering 1 through 5 depending on the type of examination. Select the appropriate mark by pressing one of the buttons at the top of the keyboard. Use the trackball to the desired area on the body mark and press enter to confirm. Press the comment key and a cursor will appear on the screen. Use the keyboard to enter in necessary comments and use the trackball to move the comment to the desired area. Press enter to confirm. To delete measurements, notes, or body marks on the image, simply press the delete button. To select C mode, press the C mode button and a box will appear on the image. To adjust the size of the box, press the enter key and move the trackball. Making the box too big will reduce the frame rate. Rotating the C-Mode button will adjust the gain of the image. To select PowerWave Doppler Mode, press the PW button. The angle can be adjusted up to 60 degrees by rotating the angle button. The perimeter is shown on the right side of the screen. The angle must be kept at 60 degrees or under. Moving the trackball will allow the line to be moved into the middle of the blood flow. Then press the update key to see the spectrum. Once a good spectrum is achieved, press the freeze button to freeze the image. To take measurements of the spectrum, press the trace key. To select a certain area of the spectrum to measure, move the trackball to the starting point and press enter. Move the trackball to the end point and press enter. The measurement results will be displayed on the screen. Press the report key to enter the report screen. The report type and patient information will be displayed on the screen. As many images as needed can be added to the report by selecting the images on the side of the screen. Descriptions and diagnostic conclusions can be typed in for each image.
press the preview button to generate a preview of the report before printing or saving. After previewing the report, it can be saved or printed. Press the exam view button to show all the different exams that have been saved. Select the desired exam to quickly print, send through DICOM, save, or delete. Using the trackball, Select the Archive option and press Enter to confirm. This will show a quick view of all the patient files that are saved. To save a file to USB, choose the desired file and select the Send To option. Image formats can be changed to several options and exported to USB. To start a new exam, press the End key. Then a new patient can be made by pressing the Patient button. To modify system settings, press the System button. The first tab is labeled General where the hospital name, department, and language can be changed. The second tab is labeled Measurement. Customize measurements that are needed or not needed under the Edit tab. The General tab allows changing the default font size, HR cycles when measuring the spectrum, and units of measurements can be customized. The third tab is the Comment tab. The fourth tab is labeled Report. The layout of the report can be customized. The fifth tab is labeled DICOM. This allows setup for the DICOM settings. Tab number six is Network, where different network settings can be changed. Tab number seven is Preset. Users can be renamed and saved for specific preset application settings. And tab number 8 is System. It allows upgrades to be made to the software when needed. Press the Menu button, rotate it, and choose Utility. Select Slideshow to show sample images with descriptions that are saved on the system. For more information or to purchase the Chison Q5 Vet, visit our website at keeboman.com.